Hello guys, let's go ahead and see how to delete all comment history in GitHub. Now you can see I'm using the GitHub desktop. Actually, why I'm going to delete is it is taking some space in my computer. So to go ahead, actually deleting the .git folder in the project folder is not the solution. Actually, it will uh, resolve some problems in your project. So all you have to do open your project folder and then go to open in terminal okay and then uh, here you have to type git checkout hyphen hyphen and then uh, you have to say o r p h a n and then uh, let's say as latest hyphen branch so this will uh, create a new branch called latest branch and then it will uh, check out otherwise it will move the current branch from the main branch into the latest branch and then here switch to the new branch latest branch now in the github desktop you can see the current branch is latest branch okay now uh, the next thing you're going to say git add git space at hyphen capital A that represent all things will be added and then you are going to commit you are going to say git commit space hyphen am and then the commit message I'm going to say some uh, uh, today commit some message should be there and then press enter okay now that is okay here we are going to say delete the branch called main in the github desktop you can see this main branch is visible so I can just uh, go to the GitHub desktop and then press this delete button. Otherwise, in the terminal, we can go ahead and say the git branch git space branch hyphen capital D main. This will delete the main branch. And if you press enter here, it will delete the main branch you can see it is deleted okay now we are going to uh, rename the current branch into the main to go ahead you are going to say git branch hyphen m main okay now we are going to push our code here you can see there are no much uh, history available so to push in the terminal you are going to type git push hyphen f origin main now this will force update your repository now uh, it is asking us to authenticate with the github so i will say web browser now i can close the window now it is writing objects depend on your project size it will take some time to upload your code into the github after this i am going to show you how we can do same thing using the github desktop software okay now uh, we have to wait until these are finished now we are going to see how we can do the same thing using github desktop now open your github desktop software and then here you are going to create a new branch so you can say here some branch name new underscore branch 
and then create the branch okay now uh, you have to select bring my changes to the new branch otherwise you will lose your changes into code okay now in the new branch I am going to commit to commit I am going to type something here as one as the first commit so and then we are going to select the current branch here and then select this uh, main branch right click on it and then click delete delete okay now I'm going to select this new branch and then rename this into main okay now this is the main branch okay now we can publish our branch now in the github desktop you will see this warning desktop is unable to push commits to this branch because there are commits to on the remote that are not present on your local branch fetch these new commits before pushing in order reconcile them with your local commits now I'm going to press fetch here but uh, it is not working actually you can see after I pressing publish branch the error is coming again so as the solution all you can do go to your project folder and then uh, here make sure the dot git folder is there for example uh, if you cannot see this uh, hidden folder you can just press this option in the more button and then go to view and then uh, show hidden files folders and drives in this section press that and then click ok now here I'm going to right click and then open in terminal you are going to type here git push hyphen f origin main you can see it is uh, currently bright in my objects it will take some time now it is completed here also in the github desktop the fetching and uh, publishing in the github it is working now there are no errors i hope this video helps if this video helps please subscribe to my youtube channel thank you